I don't care about art. I don't like art. I don't like art. Mentira, I like artists. Women in love. Ooh, is irradiating love, 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 love. Fuck. Burn your eyes. I don't have to hide myself. I don't have to pretend. I don't have to pretend. I'm not a saint. I'm not a devil. I'm Janet Arbonos. Punto y sacabo. I'm not gonna waste my time planning because it's the universe, the planets, the neighbor, the dog, the cat. Well, this is me in Croatia. I, 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 this was a very uh, emotional, emotive trip. And coming back from Croatia, and suddenly all this, I vomit all this. <laughs> me, me, me. Ah, I love this. Hmm. Decadent. Decadente. Show caliente y decadente. I love decadence uh, on prestigious ship uh, made in China. I come from Panama City, uh, but my background is very diverse. Basically, I wasn't raised like a truly 100% Panamanian and I'm sad to say I don't know how to dance salsa. Since, since I'm a kid, a baby, like I'm like drawing, 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 like drawing the, the... My first mural was in my house. I used the nail polish of my mom. Well, I was forced to leave Panama when I was uh, like uh, 11, I think, because my dad was on exile in Cuba the day that the Americans invade Panama and they make a big mess, American style, thank you very much. And I have to, to, to leave, I have to leave, but I wasn't realizing that actually this moment was the turning, the big turning point in my life. I was exchanging drawings for the art class with chocolates, chocolates or, or, or sweaters or stuff like that. And yes, this, this travels took a few years until we, we passed to Peru and Ecuador and we got stuck in Ecuador. And then, yeah, everything got worse and worse and worse and worse until I saved enough money to go back to Panama at 14 years old. And they have a advertising, like, you can win $50 if send us your caricature. So I sent it, I won. And this is how I start. This is how I officially, officially, officially started in the world of creativity and, and, and art. Every week I was publishing uh, like four or five pages full of my ideas, my angers, my, my perspective of, of, of life, of, of, of this society. Yeah, five years there, from 14 to 19, and then I jumped into television doing the same, the same thing. And then I was working in advertising agencies for a long time. And, and I felt I was giving so much to everybody that at the end I wasn't I wasn't caring about me so one day I just quit everything and I left to Costa Rica surfing for surfing and trying to get these answers what a man looks into a woman the first thing I, I say the heart the heart of the woman but actually the tits then suddenly I synthesize the concept with just a heart with tits and actually I actually have a painting of this it's a heart with tits and this painting, it's called uh, I want them to see my heart, but the tits get on the way. It took me years, took me years to, to say that. Like, yes, I'm an artist. Because I have all these connotations. When I arrived here, I was focused on, on, on selling the bags. Selling my bags, that also is, is, is an expression of myself because I use these materials from the popular culture. And my idea is to save the popular culture, give the popular culture the value that it really has. Then I'm gonna keep going because it's like giving, making just justice. I'm, I'm the justiciera del arte popular. <laughs> y, what was the question? I get bored very fast. For example, these 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 drawings uh, with inks and the pastels. I did a few, and now I don't want to touch the pastels anymore. Now I'm taking back the typography. But now I'm taking it with new materials. I never use these uh, markers, the acrylic markers, the Molotov. I never used them before. I was even hating them because many painters, uh, sometimes they, they paint with the markers and it's easy to, it's like drawing, it's not like painting. But in doing this, I find it really matches. It really matches. And once I was in Berlin, I picked the bike, 
it was actually the bike of the of another person of the another person of another person of another person it was damaged i repaired it and just naturally i was like oh i want to decorate it because i decorate everything like ah and then the bike is super famous now like people take photos photos with the bike yeah i arrived in berlin by accident actually yeah a good accident and i discovered senza nostra because i was uh, looking for a way to place my art and when I read I read many magazines and some of them not my style not my style I don't believe in this I don't like this blah, 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 blah. and I found these two magazines it was you Senza Nostra and Carl Blut, because I feel totally identified and, and, and I hope I'm gonna be frank with you and <laughs> yeah it's like I like the when I read, when, when you talk about like esoteric stuff and aliens, yes, of course, for me it was, I have to be there, you know. It's Senza Nostra with one S. Yeah. Okay, one S. Okay.